Hello again. Good afternoon to you. Time now for business. The International Monetary Fund, IMF, has approved for disbursement some $191 million to Ghana. This was after the country passed the assessment carried out to review Ghana's performance under the program. But it appears this did not come that easy for the country. George Biafé has more on the statement released by the board. The Voltic Finance team is celebrating what we call According to the IMF, the board granted some waivers to help the country secure the pass mark and ensure that the program remains on track. Sources say the country missed out on the wage bill target under the program, as well as non-accumulation of arrears. The board, however, thanked government on progress made in putting the program back on track, as well as stabilizing the economy. It was, however, worried about the fact that the country's debts are still rising and that critical measures are required to put the situation under control. On the monetary side, the IMF was of the view that authorities should continue with addressing fragilities in the financial sector, as well as the non-performing loans and problems in the microfinance sector. It also wanted the Bank of Ghana to follow up on the recent banking interventions and also ensure that the confidence is restored in the banking sector, as well as dealing with issues of solvency and financial viability. The planned $191 million disbursement brings the total amount given to Ghana since it started this program at around $764 million. The development and it would also result in more of the country's donors actually dispersing funds to Ghana to help stabilize the economy, all because of the IMF program and progress made just from yesterday. In other news, country finance manager of Voltic Ghana, Daniel Tovino, says. The water distribution company will, in the next few years, become a full beverage company. He was speaking in an interview as part of activities to mark Voltec's second annual celebration in Accra. The Financial Literacy Month, held under the theme Promoting Customer Financial Independence for a Secured Future, was organized to develop sound financial practices and investments culture among internal and external stakeholders of the company. The Voltic Finance team is celebrating what we call the Finance Literacy Month. Um, we started this program last year because we realized that we all practice some form of finance on a daily basis, individuals and businesses alike, but we are not conscious of what we are doing. Um, so we have decided to create that awareness among people that finance is a field it is something we practice every day and if we are able to equip our customers with the right knowledge their businesses will grow to continue to support Voltic. Voltic for almost 23 years now have been a leader in the mineral water business the business is expanding the environment is continuously changing and uh, Voltic is very agile uh, we now belong to coca-cola beverages africa and we see ourselves as the largest um, bottling company on the continent now so Voltic in the next um, few years will truly be a total beverage entity responding and growing with our customers and that is why we are giving them this education and that's business for now many thanks for watching